Spain remains one of the worst affected countries in the world, yet it's back to work. What's the mood like? Hi, Julia. Well, it's safe to say that uh, opinion is split on whether or not uh, the restrictions should be eased. Uh, we've been uh, going around the various uh, metro stations uh, in Madrid, speaking to the commuters. Uh, some were saying that they were grateful that they were allowed to go back to work. Some were saying that the restrictions were being, being eased far too early. All of them saying they had to go back to work. Such are the financial pressures that have been put upon them uh, because of this pandemic. And in fact, the Madrid authorities were reporting there was a 34% increase in people travelling on the metro compared to March the 30th uh, when the uh, more stricter restrictions uh, came in. And there's also been disagreement at the governmental level. The uh, president of Catalonia, Akim Tora, uh, he said he was going to defy the request by the Spanish Prime Minister, Pedro Sanchez, to, uh, to ease. Uh, the restrictions. Uh, he said he would not comply with the relaxation of the lockdown and the risk of a new outbreak was enormous. But uh, obviously, uh, Pedro Sanchez's government, they have to balance, uh, you know, the health care uh, healthcare needs of the population with trying to get the economy moving again. The economy really is struggling uh, since uh, this pandemic started. But uh, that all means getting people back to work again. And this is our report. Monday marks a loosening of lockdown restrictions here in Spain. At the largest train station in Madrid, the police were helping workers adhere to regulations by distributing protective masks. The government had planned to make wearing them compulsory, but a lack of supply made that impossible. Instead, they've issued strict guidelines. Returning workers must continue to socially distance by two metres, wash their hands regularly, cover their mouth when coughing and have no physical contact. But the move to return to work has split opinion. I've been working right throughout this pandemic. I've just taken the right precautions that we've been told to so that I can avoid the virus. For essential workers only, for sure. But it's too soon, way too soon. At the very least, they needed to wait another week and ensured that everyone remained at home. It should just be essential workers that work. The economic hibernation in place for the last two weeks has now eased. The government expects a 10% increase in traffic on all roads and motorways. It means some sectors of the economy that were considered non-essential can now resume activity. Industrial workers such as those employed in factories and the construction industry can start work after the Easter holiday. The relaxation of the lockdown comes after Spain recorded its lowest rate of infections at just 2%. The rest of Europe will no doubt be watching with interest. Well, over four million people returned to work in Spain on Monday. But whether or not this relaxation of the rules can be considered successful, well, that will only be discovered in two weeks' time. Only then we will see whether or not there's been a radical change or a spike in the figures.